This here is using uh, three computers. This is the new XP professional computer that uh, has, I believe it was 500 gigabytes of hard drive. Maybe it's 300, I forgot. But anyway, I use uh, this computer for one of the webcams that's up on the internet. And it makes a real good setup. Let's see if I can switch it over. Okay, there's one of the webcams I have on here. This one here is pointing uh, east out of the bedroom window. The other computer I'm using over here is the uh, Vista. It's also running a video cam. Matter of fact, the camera is sitting over here in the window, just like the one in the bedroom. And there's the little webcam right there, facing outside. And it's all cabled in and comes in here to this this step. Now I'll open it up here in just a second. Okay, this is the other webcam I've got set up on this one. This webcam is the one I showed you in the window. It's pointing north. So it gives an update uh, on the internet what kind of weather is going on in Deer Trail. And I also have a link that's, uh, that shows the video clips every 24 hours and stores it up on one of the servers, underground.com. And I've got this set up so I can watch uh, Prime Star, not Prime Star. <laughs> That goes back too many years. Uh, Direct TV that I have set up over here that I can watch whatever I want. I can watch this on this little monitor with the switch box over there by the main control, or I can watch it in high definition or regular uh, digital. And uh, looks pretty nice. I can record. Uh, on the VHS tape or I can record it over there to the computer. Well, let's see how come I don't have that on. There's line one. I guess I don't have the other one turned on. But anyway, I can have to turn the switcher on the other, on the other one. Okay, over here on the next computer, which we just have a small high definition TV, we don't need nothing the size of a window, but anyway here's the little Acer notebook computer that I'm using um, with the other webcam, and there it is there, kind of get up here close to it. That's the other one. That's pointing to the Deer Trail School. And the camera's right here in the window. Pointing over to the school. So it makes it pretty nice. Keeps me busy. Plus I have the web pages. Well, let's see, it looks like I got something here and I gotta either update or do something. I'll be back. Okay, well, I had to do an update on the notebook. Now I'm back over here at the Vista. Let's go open up this uh, page of uh, Deertra website. That's my, oh by the way it shows uh, 
up here on the weather with underground on this particular history of deer trail weather. It shows one of my webcams is pointing over there at school right here on the web page itself. Okay, now we'll go to Deer Trail web page that I maintain. www.deertrailco.net Okay, we'll scan down to down to the three cameras that are running 24-7 Okay, there they are. Those are the ones that are running 24-7. Then when you click on it, say you click on the one from um, the Deer Trail School, it does, uh, shows you a 24-hour clip of what happened during that 24 hours or weather-wise. And then you go to the next one. This one here is pointing south, north, north. Do the same thing with it. It shows you a clip. Then going through the nighttime. I actually see the moon come up and go down. Then it comes up in the morning and then it scans it clean up to right now at the time of uh, 112. 27. This is the one here pointing uh, east. There's a 24-hour clip. Same thing your broadcasters use for their uh, weather segments sometimes. Just there is a different location. Okay, that kind of gives you an idea. And then one of the cameras, that uh, the one on the east, I generally use it for Skype. I disable it and use the Skype, um, the other camera, to talk uh, video conferencing. Okay, so much for that. Well, I guess I better get out of it and call her today. Thank you. Have a good day.